Phoenix Multisport's a nonprofit that uses the inherent transformative power of sport and athletics to help people who are healing from a substance use disorder. And we have stuff like climbing, boxing, triathlon, mountain biking, and CrossFit's a huge part of our program. We use the name Perignum CrossFit because it's Latin for through fire. And the whole phrase is Perignum ad astra, which is through fire to the stars. And just like the story of the phoenix rising from the ashes, that's what happens here for people in recovery. I drank and did drugs all through high school. I got sober uh, September 23rd, 1990, um, in prison in Massachusetts. I found Phoenix Multisport later on in recovery. When I found out about um, Phoenix Multisport, it was because I'm in recovery. To get through tr uh, treatment for eating disorder, I started drinking and using drugs. I had always been kind of the party girl. I thought that that was who I was. This was the first time in my recovery that I felt it was okay to be who I was, a person in recovery and a convicted felon in a place other than a 12-step meeting. The first time I walked into the doors of a CrossFit gym, they accepted me for me. And I think that that was like the biggest thing. I was in that process of discovering myself. And so it was like, it just went, it just came together so well. I think CrossFit's a powerful tool for folks in recovery because it helps build community. And I think, you know, even CrossFit will talk about, you know, a, a, a addressing chronic disease, and addiction certainly is that. As a person in recovery, I'm wanting that support from people that, uh, that make me feel like I'm valued. I'm that person now who's accepting of everyone that walks in my doors. I've become more of, a little bit more of a people person, and Cross has helped with that. I was ashamed of who I was inside for the things that I had been through in my life. CrossFit in Phoenix helped me to be at peace with that. Today isn't just um, a special day for us here at Phoenix, it's a special day for one of our members of Phoenix. Today's um, his 20 year anniversary in recovery. On this day, 20 years ago, he got sober in Boston. <laughs> So the Atlas Blarney Stone competition is a competition for CrossFit athletes where they come to test their fitness, but by signing up for it, the money help actually helps support Phoenix Multisports free programs designed to help people healing from addiction. A lot of the teams that are in it are people in recovery, and many of them are coming out of the criminal justice system, they're coming out of formal treatment. When they first walked into Phoenix, they might have just been 48 hours clean and sober. As I started getting clean and I was working out on the streets, I was like, you know, I'm gonna go check this, this free place out that he's talking about. And it wasn't until like last year, about in November, I started volunteering, I started putting in my time, I started doing CrossFit. I had always um, done CrossFit and been, been in CrossFit, but you know, due to, due to my, um, my addiction, it was, it was really hard to stay consistent in athletics and in sports and stuff, but I always had a love for it. So I came over here and, um, I, I actually walked into those doors over there and I uh, and uh, just, <laughs> it's crazy, I, I tell people I was, I was just totally swooped up by these people. I've been sober for a little while and it's always amazing coming to Phoenix and things like this and being able to see how much my life has transformed from when I first got sober and then being able to see other people come in and transform their lives as well. Because no, not everyone is as fortunate as, as I am to be able to do things like this. I knew that I was going to hear other really, really inspiring stories. For me, that just gives like a whole nother like kick up and like motivation. When I started dedicating myself to CrossFit and actually dedicating myself to Parigma and Phoenix, my whole life started changing from negative every day and not knowing where I'm going to having a goal, setting a goal, and ending up here actually. I've been, you know, for the last uh, six months training for this competition. And uh, it's just great to be here. CrossFit has become 
a safe haven for people in recovery. And um, myself, you know, I'm so grateful for CrossFit and for Ignum CrossFit because it seriously saved my life. <laughs> And I think the takeaway is really that people in recovery are just like anybody else, right? We all are rising from the ashes of something. Mine just happened to be drinking and drugging. But whatever it is, we can all come together through CrossFit and support each other.